So I had to go get some McDonald's before I go to this DF Dub airport. And I just wanted to get about three minutes of y'all time real quick and just update y'all on some stuff. First and foremost, I just want to say thanks to all my fans, supporters, haters, anybody that just watched my YouTube in general, bro. I really appreciate it, bro. Y'all did a lot for me. Y'all might not really have peaked this shit, but like, my YouTube is different than most dance pages, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm posting, I'm posting dance videos every single day. If it's not a promo, it's a viral video. And secondly, I'm not in a group. Like, most dance pages you see, most people are in a group, you know what I'm saying? A solid four people or a solid five people, and you just see them every day. With my YouTube page, it's a little bit different. I'm bringing you a variety of dancers, like all the dancers from Texas. If I go to another state, then I'm going to bring those dancers to you too. If those dancers from other states come down, I'm putting those those dancers in the YouTube too. So I'm just giving you a, a nice look of everybody that just want exposure and dancing. So I just always try to isolate myself from every other dance page by doing stuff like that. Even just posting every day because everybody thinks you just supposed to post one video once every two weeks. I mean, like, people want to see footage, but, like, regardless so you got to be consistent with it and give them what they want, bro. People that watch YouTube videos, they'll always get tired of seeing the same people. So if you're bringing different people every time, they have no other choice but to keep watching at the end of the day. Because at the end of the day, bro, it's a bunch of talent, bro. And these dudes every day, you know what I'm saying, trying to get in videos that have talent, bro, that need to be seen. You know what I'm saying? That are cold, bro. So I just try to give them chances too as well with the YouTube page. With my YouTube, I get a lot of hate, bro. People hate to see you succeed, have success, and accomplish stuff, bro. The more accomplishments you get, bro, the more hate you're going to get. They do not want to see you succeed, period. <laughs> like I said, I don't ever get mad at it because at the end of the day, I don't want to be a dancer. It's not my career, and I don't want to be that when I grow up, period. I always been done dancing for fun. That was it. I just was blessed enough to get noticed from it. And start getting paid for it. And so from there, I had to keep coming with it. You know what I'm saying? I, there's no other choice. I feel like if you if you're getting paid for something, either you're skillful, talented, or you know what you're doing. You know what I'm saying? Like a lot of people do this dancing stuff for free just to get exposure. You know, I'm blessed enough to actually get paid to do the dancing stuff, and I'm not even a real dancer. Like it's people that's real dancers. You know what I'm saying? Posting videos, not even getting exposure. You know what I'm saying? Real dancers that don't even get paid for dancing. And I'm over here, just a regular dancer that just likes to do it for fun. Get hated on and get paid for it. So at times like this, bro, I can't stop, bro. Like I said, it never gets to me. Like I said, I, I see it, but I mean, if you're getting paid for it, bro, you can't complain, bro. It's like, don't get paid and nobody's going to talk about you. Get paid and people gonna talk about you. I really just get talked about, bro, and get the money, bro. At the end of the day, bro, you can buy what you want, get what you want, do what you want. And that's the bigger goal, bro. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm gonna keep pushing this shit. Like I said, it ain't my career. I dance for fun. My nigga Aspect Savvy, my nigga Party Boy Nico, my nigga Kente. Bro, them the real dancer. Them, them the dancers, bro. Y'all need to criticize them. Them are people that really want to be dancers. They really grew up dancing. I always just did it for fun. Like I said, I was blessed enough to just get seen because, I, you know what I'm saying? I link with the right dancers. You know what I'm saying? You got to be wise who you link with. You know what I'm saying? And you can't just link with one solid group. Like, I know y'all group, boom, boom, boom. But you can't just link with that group only. You got to you gotta be versatile, bro. You got you to gotta switch it up. Link with this person, link with this person, link with this person. You know what I'm saying? Because people just get tired of it. Like, they want to see new people, bro. And the more new people you bring that actually intrigues them, the more supportive fans you're going to get yourself. And that's basically what I did and what I still do now. Like I said, it's still beneficial for every dancer because at the end of the day, they're getting exposure because people are watching these videos. You know what I'm saying? So, if you just a random dancer, you know what I'm saying? Just hit me up, bro. Like, I ain't never been stingy, bro. I ain't never been like, nah, bro. I don't let any nigga. Like I said, bro, if you're good, bro, you need to be in the video. You feel me? Like, I ain't never held a nigga back. Like, if you're cold, you need to be on the YouTube page getting seen, bro. Because people are watching, bro. They need to see you. That That's a shout out for everybody. Real talk. Even with YouTube, a lot of people don't even know that I get paid for this shit. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I got blessed enough to start getting paid not off one youtube but two youtubes y'all be forgetting about my backup page right now links in the description 
Y'all go follow and subscribe right now to my backup page. That's building up quick too as well. And I've been real active on there. So y'all just go follow that as well. Appreciate that. And how it's been lately, bro, it's not even YouTube that's just paying me. Now, now with this promo stuff, y'all see how many promos I drop, bro. It's like I put at the end of every video that I promote your music. So all these up-and-coming artists are hitting me up. Bro, I need to be promoted. I need to be on your page, bro. Bro, do you, do you know what happens when it, Bro, y'all see how many? Really go through my YouTube and look at all the promos of the songs that you don't know. Those are all promos. Those are all paid promos. You know what I'm saying? So that money just builds up so fast, bro. And I do so many a day, bro. So just think about two YouTubes getting paid for and promos every single day. Five five plus promos every day, bro. It adds up, man. You'd be surprised, bro. Like, a lot of y'all just be hating. Don't even understand half this shit, bro. And I get to... The best part of it is... A dancer has to do choreography, has to do this, boom, 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 just to get paid. Man, I'm getting paid to do any move that I want. How easier does it get just to have fun, bro? Start the music. I can do a backflip. I can go to sleep for three minutes. The whole song. I can take a nap. I can sit on a chair the whole time, cross my legs, cross my arms, and look at the video. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't even have to do anything, you know what I'm saying? Like, and I just feel blessed that I can do whatever I want. And the, every promo that I do, I can do any move I want, you know what I'm saying? And I feel like, bro, you gotta, you gotta give respect where respect do, bro. A nigga get paid to do any move he want. Matter of fact, y'all say the move sorry. This nigga get paid to do sorry moves, bro. You gotta respect it, bro. Either, either you, you don't need to be watching it, you don't need to be on my YouTube, or you gotta respect it, bro. I'm out here grinding, B. Y'all niggas is sleep, nigga. Bro, I get to get in any video and do whatever the fuck I want and get paid. Niggas, niggas take this shit serious and really got to do choreography just to get paid and do certain moves. <laughs> well, come on, bro. Wake up. <laughs> Wake up, man. Nigga really out here, bro. At the end of the day, bro, y'all got to remember that I'm the owner of this account. So you, you got to just respect me, bro, because like I said, without me, you're not even going to get to see most of these dancers because most dancers in general are cocky and they're not feeling linked with just anybody. You know what I'm saying? They're more isolated. Most dancers are, are isolated or have they set people that they link with. I'm really giving y'all more than what y'all supposed to be actually seeing. You know what I'm saying? I bring people together. I bring an isolated dancer that is cold and another isolated dancer that's cold and link them together, bro. Y'all gotta start respecting that, bro. Like I said, y'all seen footage that would never ever happen without me. Without me going to get these niggas and setting up and messing with these niggas and talking this boom, boom, boom to try to set it up, bro. Y'all wouldn't even get to see most of this shit, bro. So, bro, like, y'all can't get mad at me, bro. I'm I'm just, the, I'm, supposed to, I'm supposed to be the person that you supposed to be like, yeah, bro. I fuck with that nigga, Matt, because he got boop to boop to link, and I've been trying to see them link anyways, bro. So, like, you really got to fuck with me, bro. Like I said, every dancer fucks with me in general because they know what I do. You know what I'm saying? They they know I make money doing this shit, and, I, and they respect me. I feel like you got to meet me in person and see what I do every day to respect me. If you don't, the only thing you can do is hate, bro. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm steady having all these accomplishments. I'll be mad, too. I see a nigga like, damn, he not even a real dancer. And this nigga getting all this accomplishment. It is what it is, bro. You know what I'm saying? Certain people get certain stuff to them. You know what I'm saying? And that this was just that certain thing. I really want to thank all my haters that kept me relevant, bro. Y'all done done so much for me, bro. I got to actually quit my job two years ago, bro. I was working at Kroger's. I quit two years ago. Don't ever have to work again for a long time. What I was making at Kroger in two weeks, working eight hours, making eight hours, 40 hours a week, dude. What I was making in two weeks at Kroger's, bro, I can make it one day with this dancing shit, bro. You're not understanding, bro. What I was making in two weeks at Kroger, I can make in one day. <laughs> in literally under 15 minutes, having fun. Uh, you tell me a dancer that can do that too. Because uh, you can't name more than 10 of them. You dig what I'm saying? That are trend dancers that are not even real dancers. You can't, bro. Uh, most dancers got to have a job in general. But I don't even have to have a job. I buy what I want. If I want a PS4, guess what? I'm going to go buy me a PS4. 
If I want a Versace butt, bro, I go buy me a Versace butt. I'm not buying all the designer stuff in general, though. If I want some Jordans, I go buy some Jordans. If I want a Plasma TV, I go buy it. I break my PS4 controller, guess what? I'm gonna go buy one tomorrow. I want some Little Caesars, some Pizza Hut, bro. Guess what? Your boy grubbing tonight. You dig what I'm saying, bro? If I want me a, a new Mac, laptop, new iPad, iPhone. Man, everybody know me. I walk around with seven iPhones in my hand, man. Come on, dude. Come on. I might not be a designer person, boy, but I got all the technology, man. I got like six, seven iPhones, man. Three, four laptops. Man, it just keeps going. You you dig what I, what's going on, bro? The more of the story, bro. I appreciate all y'all haters, bro. Y'all still keeping me relevant today, bro. Y'all still keeping my name in y'all mouth. And, it, I mean, it just keeps increasing. Like, y'all only making me more successful. You know what I'm saying? Y'all only paying me more money. Like I said, I don't have to worry about a job. I, all I got to do is worry about every day doing what I got to do to improve what i try trying to accomplish in general. Like I said, I just last semester, I finally graduated with my associate science. So, that's another blessing. So, now, I got a couple months before I go back to a, a university. So I got a couple months on, on, on my time right now to do what I got to do with this damn shit to just prosper with it. You feel what I'm saying? So I really didn't take advantage of this shit. So I'm really on go. You feel what I'm saying? But y'all really got to catch the drift, bro. For real. So all the haters that be like, bro, Matt, you need to stop this damn shit, bro. You suck, bro. You got you to gotta get this shit up, bro. Why is Matt dancing? Why would I stop, bro? It's too much money, bro. Y'all are asleep. Y'all are asleep, bro. I would have been quit if I wasn't making no money doing this shit. I would have been quit dancing, bro. I would have been ducked out. I would have been having fun. I would have went to parties, had fun. I would have stopped posting. Why would I keep posting? Y'all not understanding. Why would I keep posting, bro? It's got to be another story behind it, bro. Your boy is making money, bro. Y'all got to realize this shit, bro. Like, why would I stop, bro? So that I, then I got to go back to Kroger's, go back to Starbucks, go be a manager at Jack in the Box. Like, do what y'all doing. Like, Watch other people videos. Why would I do that? Why? That's not even smart. Even if I'm not good and I'm making money, why would I stop? <laughs> Y'all niggas give the worst advice. If I'm making money doing it, support it. Get the fuck out of here, bro. Because y'all niggas are, are talking nonsense to me, bro. You're not talking logical, nigga. You're not talking like, bro, the bigger picture, bro. You're not, bro. Like I said, bro, I make all this money doing this shit, right? I'm the sorry dancer, but I'm still getting exposure doing this. And I'm still getting known and more known and more known. and becoming a person, a figure in the dancing as a person that is actually known for dancing. That is the funniest shit to me. And like I said, bro, shout out to all the fucking haters, bro. I fuck with y'all niggas like double jazz, bitch. Like I always say, nigga, not yesterday's money, nigga. Today's money. Yeah. <laughs>